Hello, and welcome to episode 9 of my Let's Play of Fable of the Lost Chapters. My name is Wolverine, and when we left our hero, he had just arrived back in the town of his birth, Oakvale, which burned down. And we uh, met a pirate and played some golf, and looted some graves. So, let's see what else there is to do in town. Vandalism of someone's property will not be tolerated in town. Watch out for the guards. Here we are. I'm just outside the uh, graveyard with Sir Terry Wogue in there. Not really. Ooh, another grave. I didn't spot this one last time. The grave reads, I love it. The world looks beautiful. Isn't that lovely? Ooh, loot. Sorry if you can hear the rain, it's quite heavy outside. Need a good sword to fight beside you? I genuinely will. When I leave the village, I will come and bring you with us. Have a nice day, will you, sir? I do. How about you do something romantic for me? Go on then. Hey. What a man. I'll give you a beer. That is really kind. Thanks. Welcome. We feel much happier with him here. Thanks. Oh, ah, people are so nice. Oh yeah, that name. <laughs> yeah, you can't just trespass in someone's house, they'll get upset. There's a chest there and I'm gonna steal from it. Well I'll steal. Our space the great. <sighs> Resurrection Vial. Oh! I've been watching my videos back. Uh, see nepotism for an explanation. But um, I've noticed that there is a limit to how much stuff you can carry. But the game doesn't tell you that, it just throws things away. So, for example, uh, what I just picked up, the Elixir of Life. No. Nope. Oh, resurrection vial. Six. Oh, wait. No. Times five. Huh. I thought there was a limit. Find a better example. Produce. So, meat, eight, fish. I'm sure there was like a number. Huh. No, there isn't a limit. But hey -o. My mistake. No, I thought it like... You could only carry maybe four of those things at a time, and then if you picked up any more, they just vanished. Have a nice day, won't you, sir? Your voice carries really far. Um, Our space. I think that might be in a later game. So, uh, yeah, you can sell those resurrection vials if you want. I mean, so far I've done pretty well. I don't think I'll need six all at once, so maybe I will if I need the money. What up? Oh. Hello. Can I ask you a personal question? Have you yeah. ever tried blue mushrooms? I shared one with this guy in the Guild Woods the other night, and it was just amazing. I've never connected with someone like that before. I wonder if it was the same for him. Oh no. Oh, Cyril. He was so sweet. Oh no. Wait. Oh, hello. Have you ever tried blue mushrooms? I've never connected with someone like Oh, Cyril. He was so sweet. But how do I know what we felt was real? Oh, I was kind of expecting a quest or something there, but oh, she's just telling me about her day. So there's this guy named Cyril out there. I don't want to help you, I really don't care. Hope very well. For your health and safety, boil water before drinking. <laughs> uh, you say water. <laughs> hmm. I'll take your word for it. Ooh, a nice picnic table. Uh, nothing. Okie dokie. Maybe 
moving swiftly on. So the green dot on the map up there, I think, is uh, Terry Wogan. Need a good sword to fight beside you. Sword. Yes, I do. And the green dot by the uh, beach is the chicken guy. I'll leave him alone for now. Chicken kicking is all well and good, but we can do that another time, I think. Let's see if our old house is still here. It wasn't on fire when we left. Yeah. Is that a for sale sign? Nice to see you. Yes, it is. You can't afford this home. It costs 5,000 gold. It's my home. I don't need to buy it. Did I surrender all rights when I joined the guild? Am I actually paying the guild? Swines. What money do I have? 1,786. I am quite a bit short of cash for that. I wonder if I can sell any of my stuff in the shop at the bottom of the street. That's a very big glowy thing you've got there. Trade. To serve you. Sell items. Potions. Ah, oh, I can't sell the... Oh wait, no, it's an elixir of life. I keep calling it that. So I can sell it. It's worth 500, but it'll only give me 455. Can I only sell... Ah, oh, that's what I thought it was. So, I said number in stock, zero out of zero. So, resurrection violets, three out of four. So, maybe you can only buy one off me. Yeah. And that's, I'm still well short of 5,000. Doesn't seem really worth the trouble of selling it. He's going to give me next to nothing for all this food. Other stuff? You'll buy back the spade for a loss of 55. Really, I hope that your mother isn't killed in an accidental oh, yachting accident. Does the... I feel like I should go back to the guild at some point. Ooh, armour! I seem to remember picking up a massive weapon last time. Again, I had to watch the thing back. Obsidian Grey Tax. Worth 31.20. Prop. Cost. 28.39, so less than it's worth, but that's putting me a lot closer to 5,000. Quite a lot closer to 5,000, in fact. I wouldn't have to sell much more to get to 5,000. Why didn't I pick up these things? It's amazing how quickly you forget things when you're doing a let play. So yeah, I'm going to sell some stuff and buy a house. I want somewhere to sleep. I might use that. I'm using that now. Um, no. And again. That's the one I got as an apprentice. What am I going to do with it? I can't display weapons in this game, I don't think. I'll see what else I got. I've only got one bow. Clothing. You'll buy my villager gloves. No, you won't. And villager, villager clothing. What about price? What else we got? Ooh, lightning augmentation. I might use that. Tell you what, I'll sell some of my resurrection vials to the other fella. Says Orchard Farm's got some weird goings on. Somebody's probably screaming at me for selling the obsidian grey tax, but seriously, the game, the Weapons in this game are quite mad. Why do you keep coming over here? I'm pleased to serve you. Sell this thing that I'll probably regret selling. One. There we go. Still got five. That's loads. My cousin says Orchard Farm's got some weird goings on. So you see in the top left of the screen, the heart has got a number in it. That's how many resurrection vials you're carrying. Buy and sell a house. Let's go and buy back our own house from probably the people who'd killed our parents. But hey ho. 
That's capitalism for you. Buy this lovely marital home for 5,000 gold. Yes. Rent out. Oh, I'm living here. There is a bed. There is an important quest card at the guild for you. An important quest card at the guild for me. Sure you want to use this bed? Yes, no. It does seem a little bit early. Nothing in there. Nice roaring fire already set. That's nice. Log chairs. Bookcase with books on it that I can't interact with. And bookcase that's barely hanging up. I wonder if my sister's diary's still here. Well, I own a house. So what are the options here? Sell it now. Rent it now. What's this one then? You can't afford to decorate this house. It costs two and a half thousand gold. So I can improve the decor. Yeah, there's a lot of room for improvement in here. Well, I've got somewhere to hang my hat, as it were. If only I owned a hat. I can't afford a hat now. All I have is a house. <laughs> it's like living in London. Hmm. Ooh, another chest. It's just popped up in the last seven years or so. Mine. And it's, uh, gold. Very good. 543 to my name. That sounds like a lot of gold to me. No boats. Bobbing. No crew on them. Right, I seem to remember there being a cave at the end of this beach. Let's go see where else we can go before we start doing questing again. The cliff top path. Oh wait, Terry! We forgot Terry! There might be some violence to be had it. I hope they can hire him for less than 543 gold. I believe the buildings on the map are colour coded, so green would be an inn or a tavern, purple is weapons or armour, and gold is general goods. Not to be confused with specific goods. Well, Family guy joke there for you. Come on, where are you? Oh, I've lost him. I'm going the wrong way. Yep, literally know this level. Need a good back my hand to fight you. Good day, hero. If you need someone to fight evil by your side, I'm your man. It's not necessarily evil we'll be fighting. I the hero. Excellent. Yeah. There is true honor in work. When you're done with my services, just talk to me again. Together, we'll bring evil in Albion to its knees. <laughs> Ten gold. Okay. And he's got a health bar there as well in the top right. I thought it cost a bloody fortune. If you hire someone in Skyrim, you've got a remortgage. But you just pay them the once and they follow you for all time. I hope he's not charging by the hour. This could be a very short relationship. I'm guessing that orange dot on the map is him and he's gotten stuck on the terrain. Yes, he got stuck on nothing. Cree? That's a weird name. Right, Cree, um, it's getting dark and I'm gonna go to bed in my house. You're welcome to sleep outside. Okay, you can sleep in front of the fire. You have taken the right path in life, that's for sure. Yes, he does charge by the hour, it seems. So you want to use his bed? Yes. It's all better. Hang on. Remembering a game mechanic now. If you can get an NPC to follow you, as in they have this follow symbol above their head, and you go to bed, you sleep with them. I may have just slept with uh, Cree here. Hmm. Oh well. 
you know, sexuality is quite fluid in the world of fable. There's no, um, what's the word? Prejudices whatsoever about that sort of thing. You can marry whoever you like. I remember seeing an article in a gaming news uh, magazine at the time, and they had a full-page picture to represent this um, fact about the game, which was extraordinary at the time. And they had a picture of game show host, actor, and comedian Graham Norton with the words "It's okay to be gay." I've not done any fighting yet, but I do like your uh, enthusiasm. It'll come in handy, I'm sure. Uh, oh, this is a this is a dead end. There's nothing here. Wait a minute. Yes, confirm. There is nothing here. Ah, Let's go. There is an important quest card in the guild for you. <sighs> what are these? Oh, big gate. It is locked. Ah, well, looks like we're going back to the guild, I suppose. And why do I only sleep for like four hours? It's the middle of the night. What's all that about? Oh, I didn't Pull up it. ahead. Nope. What? It was just a shadow. <laughs> right, let's go back to the guild by doing this. Oh, I can go to any warp point. Oh, that's useful. Find zero gold. That attracts your uh, bounties, I suppose, if you have any. Okay, fine. We'll go to the guild. Ooh, he comes with us. He doesn't have to walk. I'm quite looking forward to him turning up five minutes later. Promising. Huh? Who are you? Oh, hello. You must be the kid Maze is always talking about. Can't imagine what he sees in you. Still, I suppose Maze knows best. Nice tattoos. But where are my manners? I'm Briar Rose. No doubt you've heard of me. Nope. No time for autographs, I'm afraid. I have to get to Knothole Glade for an important mission. Well, Speaking the Gryffindor of which, scarf. if you came for a quest card, all the best ones have gone already. Oh. I'm sure the guild can find you something to do, though. I hear the kitchens need cleaning. I was doing that for seven years. So, Briar Rose is one of the other heroes of the Heroes Guild. We've already met Thunder and Whisper qualified when we did. Oh, you're still charging. I better move on. So, protect Orchard Farm or attack Orchard Farm. So protect, help the guards defend from a bandit assault. 750 gold, 400 reward. Lead the bandits to the crates and cover their backs while they steal them. Money reward 1,000. Renown reward 400. And boasts. I think that, I don't know what that is. Well, we have a moral choice, ladies and gents, and the moral choice coin is ready. And it's good. Ah, oh. Fine. Protect the damn farm, get you 750 gold. Take quest and boast. Um, boast how, precisely? Oh, protect Orchard Farm. Naked. Yay! Take no damage. No. Fist fighter. Make sure no boxes or artifacts are stolen. And show well, that no guards will die. Here. Say that. Hooray! Right, we're done here. So this is what this place is. This is where you boast about how you're going to do the quest. Going. No, you have taken the right going. path in life. That's for sure. Oh, you know we can do it. Right, um, can I get closer using fast travel? So, Bowston South is further, Oakvale is further, Barrel Fields is further, Greatwood Collis Gate is about as far away as we are now. So, we are as close as we can get. Let's move it. Run, yes. Amen. Oh, you're still here. Hey. I think you'd have travelled far. Nope. Yep. More money. 
I'm guessing this place will be swarming with baddies. So you're going to be doing some work down at Orchard Farm, are you? Hello, Whisper. I knew that was your two calling. I saw Lady Grey set the opposite quest in the guild yesterday. Maybe I should pick it up. I hope you've been practicing. You'll need all the experience you can get to beat me. See you later, farm boy. Huh. So she's doing the opposite. Your combat experience multiplier allows you to increase the experience you earn from battles and invisible in the upper left portion of the screen. The more damage you inflict without getting hit, the higher multiplier becomes next. Try to get your multiplier as high as possible in the following battles to maximise the experience you earn next. Okay. Combat multiplying. I'm ready. Thank you. That one. Let's murder some. You see something. Beetles! Ow! Already hit me. Experience earlier, and it's gone. Damn it! Come on, Sir Terry. Oh, it's one of these things. Prepare to fight. Easy as that. Attacking. That goes in fast. Oh, bandit. So maybe this is what everybody was blathering on about Orchard Farm for. Oh, it's saving the game so you can't cheat. <laughs> yeah, you can't save mid-quest, as I recall. It doesn't do anything. Chickens! Oh, thank Avo, you're here. I thought no one would answer our guild request. I've arranged some more security to back you up, but there are so many bandits that they'll tear my farm apart. I wish we'd never found those damn stones. They brought us nothing but trouble. My wife Jenna won't let them anywhere near the house, so we've left them in some crates in the barn. They must be worth a fortune. They say Lady Grey wants them. I've already lost three farmhands in these raids. Who? Oh. That must be them now. I'd better go inside and look after my wife. She's terrified. Uh, okay. Whoops. No. Cute. Why? Why did my weapon go away? Death to all! 
Well done everybody. So they're coming from this direction. Look out! More bandits! I don't see any. I mean the map says they're coming. There's one. It's an honor to fight beside such a Put fearless you. hero. This will hurt. Yeah. Yeah. Prepare to fight! It's killing time! Let's go! Oh, there we go. We've got two guards on our side as well, isn't that great? These guys really mean business. Look out! More bandits! Where? Well, I'm guessing from this direction again. Why don't they just all come at once? I really need to remap the lock to the button I can actually reach when I'm playing. More? How long is this going on for? Oh, it's done. So, you've learned some new moves, have you? Actually, no. Well, you're not the only one. If anything, I've forgotten something. I hope some. you've learned how to flourish, because that's the only way you're going to get close to me. Ah, the Go game's on. still pandering Try to you. Try to hit me with a flourish. Use melee attacks to increase your combat multiplier, and you'll earn a special flourish move when the flashing X icon appears and a purple glow appears on your weapon. Really can't miss it. Press the right mouse button to form a powerful, unblockable attack. Okay, so we're just going to spar a bit. So you can Flourish. do it. I'm still going to beat you, though. Oh, the uh, so Terry's coming to help. Prepare to fight. Kick her ass, Terry. Flourish. We really should get out of this pond, but you know. Is your brother going to come along and tell you you're an idiot? There you go. Damn! You beat me again! I suppose this quest is yours then. Yep. But you can't stay lucky forever, farm boy. We're bound to meet again. And I'll be ready. So long, loser. You did it! I can't tell you how grateful we are! Someone should be round to pick up the boxes soon, so we shouldn't have any more problems. Can't see why there's been so much fuss about those stones. Been glad to see the back of them myself. Must be worth plenty of money to someone, though. I'll make sure to tell everyone about you. We need heroes like you around. Oh, shucks. Okay, something wrong with the sound there, but... Cheers. We'll fight no evil standing around. Ooh, I got Whisper's brooch, and it looks like, um... A traditional African shield of all things. No guards will die, extra money. So I did get paid the same as I would have if I'd have just taken the evil quest. Check the guild for more quests. Get ready. Okay. This looks nasty. This is a farm. You can stop. It's been lovely, but goodbye. Very Cost well. Money. May we meet again. Oh, oh please. He's just I don't know what just happened. Terry Wogginton teleports, it seems. Is there nothing that man can't do? Right. Well, back to the guild, I suppose. Uh, G. G, G, G. Where's G? Walking is for chumps. Training any nice young men. There goes the tough old guild master. Oh, I can do some leveling. 
So we seem to be doing mainly melee. I can... Oh, I did that last time, so health, toughness. Health, you are the more damage you can take. Your health attribute defines the length of your health bar. Health increases the amount of damage you can take. Oh, yeah. It also makes you look less scrawny. They do look quite scrawny. Oh, Speed can... makes you quicker in both ranged Speed. and melee combat. Oh, that's useful. Accuracy allows you to cause more damage in ranged combat and make oh. your shots more precise. Ooh, we decapitated that flower. Guile increases your stealth and improves your trading skill. Oh, there's a stealth system. Who knew? Oh yeah, because of that. Um, what's it called? Ooh, all these other spells. Physical shield, berserk, assassin rush, half life, ghost sword, multi arrow. Ooh. Surround spells. <gasps> Slow time. Yes. Yes, this is definitely worth it. This spell affects the very fabric of time itself, slowing everything around you to a crawl while leaving you, the loot user, or caster immune. Higher levels allow the caster to maintain this state for longer and bring the world nearly to a standstill. Very useful when you let's play. Notice your experience pool is going down. You will always use your will experience first, but if this runs out, you can use general experience to improve any of your attributes. To gain yes. more will experience, you magic power increases your capacity for storing mana. Okay, so we've done a bit of strength, we've done a bit of that. Um, go on, I'll have some accuracy. I don't think Guile's going to come in much use around here. Speed? Yeah, why not? I'm such a noob. More accuracy. And more accuracy. <laughs> Toughness makes you more resistant to damage. Natural armor. So your base DT if it was uh, Fallout. I have eaten a lot of meat, so I can do this a few times, I think. Put that health bar up. I'm sick of him telling me that my health is low. That should do for today. Oh, I've still got a little bit left I can do. No. I don't want those other skills. I'm good. Yeah, there we go. All leveled up. Looking fine. Can we still sleep in our old bed? I wonder what he's doing. No, wait, no, we can't. But I will take a book. And nothing. Three haikus by Miko the Bard. Miko the Bard. Hmm. Finish with a bit of poetry, why don't we? Inventory. Or is it journal? Hero status. Log book. Books. Terrible beauty. Building scream in agony. Oakvale is burning. Warrior or mage, choose evil or choose goodness. A beard or mustache. <laughs> Guard of Albion. Sleeping until the true blood flows red on its blade. Hmm. Give that to the school. Uh, school teacher. School guy. Idiot. Right. We shall be back next time, folks, to... Uh... Wait, did I even pick, a... pick another quest? No, I didn't. Let's pick another quest, folks. That's what I meant to do, not just levelling up. I have to have something to look forward to, I think. So we're stronger, tougher, and I haven't eaten in days. Eat the big lump of meat. Um. Trader escort or hob killing contest. Not 
renowned enough to take on the Hob Cave quest. Scott traders the Darkwood in Darkwood safely to Barrel Fields. Okay. Just come from there. I'll clear Orchard Farm of Hobbs. That sounds like more fun. Post. Kill at least ten more hobs and whisper. That's possible. Do the quest naked. I mean, I just just did upgrade my toughness. So go on then, and we'll see if we can do more than whisper. That's enough. Yes! Go on. Hello everybody, goodbye. That was great. Wait. Arse face is starting to wear a bit thin. Oh hello there, hero. What have you got for me? We can do a special offer for you, sir. So chicken chaser, pie master, saber, hood, rune master, ranger, ooh. Ooh, oh, I can afford a lot of these now. Let's do... Let's just go through them. We'll do them all one at a time. So now I shall be known as Chicken Chaser. The farmers have had stuff stolen. Weird yes. devices they were. Gone. Right. We shall embark on our great quest to kill some little creatures next time, folks. If you have been, thank you for watching. I look forward to playing again next time.